are you? Hello. Hey, May. Hi, AJ. <laughs> How are you? Thank you so much for jumping in. Thank you for inviting your followers. Hey, May Face. How are you, AJ? Hey, I don't remember your name, but I know House of Hame, and I remember, I'm on your Instagram page, but what is your name again? Hey, Andra, how are you? Hey, 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 everyone. Hey, Miss Taylor. Hello, hello. Hello, everyone. Sabrina. Okay, House of Hame. Sabrina, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. How is everyone doing this wonderful, what are we on, Tuesday? Is doing what? Oh, you need to charge it real quick. I came on here because today is Tuesday. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. You miss me? I miss you too, Miss Taylor. I came on here to say something without saying it. So some of you all will know exactly what I'm talking about and others of you will not. But the message is still the same. I came on, welcome everyone who came in, people who I did not see or acknowledge, people who are on the web. My name is Adrian B, also AB Royalty. Um, I miss you too, Margaret. I don't know if I responded, but I do. I miss I miss all y'all. <laughs> um, I am a clothing designer. I, I have my hand in a couple of different jars. Um, but what I came on today to talk about is God's perfect will is better than ours. So some of you know that I uh, was stepping into um, the next phase of my life, which regardless of how this everything plays out, I'm still stepping forward into the next phase of my life. However, congrats to Janae. Janae, you're in here. Tell her thank you. Um, yes, and Janae, my daughter, opened up her uh, online store. You can find her. Uh, somebody type it in, please. www.shantees.com. Her middle name is Chantel. Chantel's t-shirts. Chantel. Shantees.com. Name, type in your own website, sweetie. Um, and she opened up her site. And the shirts look amazing. I'm super proud of her. Um, she's very creative and she's coming up with these concepts and we have mugs, we have, um, what do we have name? Mugs, t-shirts, hoodies, tank tops. We also do custom orders. Uh, they will not be the same prices as, as what's on the website, but, um, you can email Janae at info, pickles, pickles, I don't know, info at Shanties. Dot com they pop that in there as well but I came on to say that our will and God's will sometimes are not the same you know sometimes we pray we want something and we pray for it and sometimes it's not God's perfect will and sometimes you discover that as you're walking out the steps so I said that to say some of you know what steps I've just recently taken and that door has been postponed um, so I stepped out on faith, but that door has been postponed. Uh, it could be a couple of months. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pray. I'm gonna go back to the Father and just regroup and figure out what his perfect will is and just continue to move forward in that. I do have some other business launches to do uh, within the next week or so. Uh, Janae's was launched this week, but mine will be launched next week. But the door that I thought that I should be walking through was not the one for me right now so I had to regroup and keep it moving but I have to submit my will to his will and when you submit your will to his will things will always work out for your good um, all things work together for the good of them that love the Lord and are called according to his purpose so I have no choice but to trust him and when we go through things uh, it's not a surprise to God it could be a surprise to us Sometimes we feel blindsided by things. And I'm not even saying I felt blindsided. I was kind of like, oh, okay. But it is about trusting him and it's about really believing him and knowing that regardless of how, what goes on and goes down, that you're always gonna end up on your feet. You're always gonna end up okay. So I just came on to say, to trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not to your own understanding and acknowledge him in all of your ways and he'll make your path straight. So that's for me today. And that is for some of you who are watching. That's for some of the replay viewers. You're pouting? Hey. I throw my hands up and I surrender. Because it's not my will, it's God's will. Um, so I'm excited about what he's doing. I am in another city right now. And I will be um, back home tomorrow. <laughs> but um, 
whatever his will is. If it's his will for me to pursue this at a different time, then I will. And if not, then I won't. But I surrender my will to God's will. And that's that. Well, I hope you all have had a wonderful day. I'm not necessarily ending this. Something big is... Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're right. You're 100% right, AJ. And it's like, it's not my job to try to figure out what God is doing. It's my job to be willing and obedient to his perfect will. Right? I have to walk out his steps. I have to do what I know he said to do. And then I know that he's got me in the long run. So, none of it matters. So, it's all good. I'm grateful to him regardless. What is it? it it's yes and amen whether it's what I set out to do or not. He always has our best interest in heart. He does. He's our father, like literally our father, right? You're welcome. He does. He always has our best interest in heart. And if we submit our will to him, it's always just going to, it's going to, like you said, something big is coming and I wouldn't have been available for it had I pursued this. Yes, yes and amen. Yep. Had I pursued this goal that I had, I wouldn't have been available for whatever it is he's getting ready to do. And whenever that does happen, I'll come back on and say, let me tell you what he did. Let me tell you about my Jesus. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I'm smiling and laughing. I'll be returning home tomorrow. So there's that. <laughs> but yeah, I receive whatever he's doing because it is big. And you have to just put your ducks in a row. You have to be obedient to those little things that you know he wants you to do. So I know that I took the right steps. I just know that the direction I thought he was going in, he's not. So life is about keeping your skates on because when stuff changes, you got to change direction and you can't get caught up on the fact that something changed and it could be something big, but instead of getting caught up on the fact that something changed, put your skates on and just shift directions because whenever it unfolds, it's going to be amazing and we have to just continue to trust him. And so I'm trusting him today and I hope that you all are trusting God for whatever it is that you're waiting for and know that if the direction that you're waiting for shifts don't be upset just um thank him praise him keep it moving so that is what i came on to say today i hope you all have had a wonderful tuesday i appreciate all the hearts i thank you for the 18 people that are in here the people who are communicating the people who are not able to communicate um yeah so yeah <laughs> how is everybody today how's everybody's day girl hey I said you know I you everything that I go through a deal with I might throw up a status and it's not I'm not saying it to other people nine times out of ten if I put a status up it's something that the Holy Spirit is dealing with Adrian with so the what Adrian does is share it with someone else because I know he's not only saying that to me it could be a word for someone else so if I go through something I'll run into a brick wall and slide down I'm like okay what was the lesson in that and then I'll type out the lesson on Facebook somebody will always say you know I really needed to hear that well I, what I don't say most times is I just scrape my face up on a brick wall too <laughs> or some encouraging words we are eye to eye with that yeah it's or just encouraging words or just a, a joke something to make people laugh because for the most part people walk around here depressed you never know who's depressed and who's got real life issues going on heavy heavy stuff that they would never tell anyone <laughs> They would never tell anyone what they're going through and you cracking a silly joke, which some people might be like, ah, she's corny or whatever, but that's fine. Someone needed to laugh because they may have been contemplating suicide. You never know. So, um, I want to say always be true to who you are, um, and always humble yourself enough under God. I'm not talking about under people. Humble yourself under God and he will always direct your path, always. I appreciate all the love. My favorite colors are popping up today. Oh, this purple. This is purple, turquoise, blue, boom, gold. Living my life like it's golden. <laughs> yeah, today really went, I can't say it went left, but today it was nothing like I thought it would be. It wasn't a horrible day. It just, a door, I can't even say it closed. I can say it kind of, it's a delay, delay, one of those delay but not denied. It's a delay, but it's not necessarily a bad delay. So, put my skates on and shift. 
When I move, you move. Just like that. It's the Holy Spirit say that. Not like the other song, but you know what I'm talking about. When he moves, I'm to move. And when he stands still, I'm to stand still. And when he says no, it's no. And when he says yes, full force ahead. <laughs> yep. So that's what I came on to say. We're all still students learning. Nobody has it all figured out. No one. I don't care who they are. I don't care if they're the head, pastors, bishop, bishops, apostle, apostles, prophet. No one has it all together. A prophet's main job is to hear from God and say what God says. That's it. It is a see and say. I tell my sister I have a see and say ministry. When the Holy Spirit says something, I hear it and I say it. That's what a prophet's job is. It's not any of the other stuff. But everyone has to... Every knee shall bow, every tongue confess that Jesus is Lord, and every person has to humble themselves before God. So, I don't know why I'm all over here in that direction, but that's all I came on here to say. I think I look shiny. I think it's the light. Let's see. That's all I came on here to say. What are you guys doing? Blink, 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 blink. What are you ladies and gentlemen up to this evening? Nothing. Me either. Nay, I'm getting ready to go into that drop box. Thank you. And you're looking beautiful too. Ashley. <laughs> you watching me? Yes, I'm getting ready to go into drop box. Nay, chilling with the family. You have a beautiful family. Those children are amazing. You all look like twins. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Thank you. Thank you, Ash. Yeah. Laying in the bed, girl, girl. I'm about to, somebody um, asked me if I wanted to go hang out and I don't think I do. I think I wanna just hang out here for a little while and work on some things. And I have to learn, y'all have, have to all learn. Everybody in here, there's 20 people at least. Learn how to say no. The answer is not always yes. Sometimes the answer is no. And don't feel bad when you say no. You say no, no is a complete sentence. Repeat after me. You don't have to type it, just say it. No is a complete sentence. You don't necessarily owe an explanation when you say no. It's polite to say, you know, no. You don't have to give an excuse. If the answer is no, it's no. And you gotta be confident in your no. And uh, don't always bend, back, bend over backwards at your own expense. It's one thing to sow and reap, but it's another thing to bend over backwards at your own expense. And yeah, no, so said that because yeah someone asked me if I'm gonna hang out later and I think I'm just gonna chill I think I'm gonna say no I got some things yeah Margaret no I'm just kidding it's for whoever <laughs> if the cap fits let them wear it if the shoe fits let them wear it and all that other stuff <laughs> you know we don't always have to say yes yeah sometimes the answer is no yep well that's it I am really shiny this light is bright let's see if I can what can I nope just looks like I'm shiny. Let's see. Boom. So all of those people in here that know what I'm talking about when I say that I'll be home tomorrow, that that happened. <laughs> yes. But to God be the glory, right? Is it a glow? Because it looks like I'm not sweating, but it almost looks like I don't know what it is. Is it the soul glow? Did I put too much sheen on this morning? What is, what's really going on? <laughs> Am I crying on oh, my nose? No. I, to me, it's shiny like here. Is that my T-zone, Andra? Talk to me about my T-zone, Andra. <laughs> Think, darling, darling. Is it, is it a soul glow? <laughs> I don't have a jerry curl. Is it a soul glow? <laughs> Thank you. I feel like it's oil sheen or something. I don't know. But, do, yes. <laughs> Don't have me on here act crazy. Yes. Dewy. Like the dew. Is it like the dew in the morning? What was I going to say? Oh, the song that was in my heart on Saturday? Sunday morning. When I first woke up. The first song that I heard was when Jesus says yes, nobody can say no. And I'm, I mean, the song was playing in my spirit so loud, I had to turn it on. So I turned it on, and I'm listening to it, and I'm singing it. 
and I'm listening to it and I start, yes, and I start like jamming to it, but little did I know, he was, God, he warns us, saints, he warns, he'll tell you, he'll tell you without telling you what's about to happen. He said, if I say yes, nobody can tell you no. So, he does, so yeah. It's like he said that and then he allowed me to walk out these steps, but keeping the faith on the fact that he said, when I say yes, nobody can say no. So I'm trusting his yes. Yes to his perfect will. Yes, Jesus, yes. <laughs> That's it. Thank you, sis sisters and brothers. That's all I came on to say. Okay, somebody changed the subject. I don't know what else to talk about. <laughs> Well, everyone who's on here, if you would check out Janae's um, website, I think she might be doing, yes, we are in agreement. I think she might be doing, hmm, I won't say a giveaway, but she might do like a coupon for her first week. We'll figure it out. I think Nay is in here still. Aren't they cute, cute ideas? She's good. She, she'll think of stuff and she'll send it to me. We work together. I'm the creative director, but Janae is, um, she's Jay Chantel. She's Shanties. So I'm excited. What she's going to offer on this website will be t-shirts, tank tops. Uh, she's going to, she is a sock fiend. Like she loves, the, the melanin shirt is cute, right? <laughs> sounds good. Sounds good. She, um, she's into socks. Like, you know, some teenagers are into socks. Janae is all about socks. So we're looking for her. Uh, she's going to be selling socks and accessories and and um aj through this site we'll also be doing those custom tutus so we'll be doing yes i mean like sock and you know they never match like 375 pairs of socks and they never match one short one long i'm like all right whatever <laughs> enjoy your socks if this is what makes you happy striped <laughs> striped and pink and then silver and red on the other foot merry christmas <laughs> this is a gift right they never match um, so she'll be selling accessories and socks, um, and what was I going to say? Oh, custom tutus. So we make tutus for babies all the way up to women, uh, adults. So yeah, that's something else that will be added to the site. She will also be adding a couple of items per week on Fridays. So there'll be new items every Friday. So if you see anything and you love it, let us know. If you have any questions, again, info at shanties.com. Why is this phone not charging? It should be charging. Info at shanties.com. We'll get all of your questions answered. Yes, we do custom t-shirts. Uh, the prices will not be what's represented on the website. Those are different because uh, it's through a different distributor. So if you have any questions, let us know and we'll hook it up for you. Yes, info at shanties.com. We're on Instagram. We're on Twitter. We're everywhere. Facebook. You can make purchases through Facebook, but it kind of, it shows you the price, but then it takes you back to her website to make the actual purchase. Um, yeah, the t-shirts start at around 22. I think the tank tops might be around the same price. There's 11 ounce mugs, there's 15 ounce mugs, and there are cute mugs too. Yeah, but um, thank you all. I'm gonna end the scope. They're not there yet, but we will, we'll get them up there. We'll get them up there. Yep, these kids and these socks. <laughs> the socks will be on within the next couple of weeks. I'll let you know, AJ, once they're on. Yes, ma'am. Thank you all for the compliments, and hopefully they're still in there. Yeah, girl, socks. Girl, I don't need, I don't need no. <laughs> I have on socks, and they match, okay? My socks match. <laughs> I'm just fucking out. All right, ladies and gents, I will um, I may get back on later. If not, then I will see you soon. I appreciate you for stopping in. Um, thank you for always being present. Thank you for all of your hearts. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your love. I appreciate it all, and I will talk to you all very soon. Bye, ladies and gentlemen.